Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to Naturally Tanya. So as we can see, we are jumping on into today's video and I am taking down my box braids. Um, just showing you guys the method that I use. I usually cut my box braids because nobody has time to like unbraid those long braids. Like that's not the move. So I definitely, because I have blonde at the end of my hair, it is a little bit easier. I just typically look to see where the blonde ends and then I cut about an inch or two below that point just in case my eyesight is off or there's some new growth or what have you just to ensure that I'm not cutting my actual hair off. Um, so a good rule of thumb is, I mean typically you know the length of your hair when you're installing the braids. You just want to estimate where your typical hair length is and just go two inches below that. That's my rule of thumb. Um, and then I'm also using my aloe vera juice and water mix to help get rid of some of that yucky matting. Y'all see it. It's not cute. That's really why I had to take the braids out. Um, I thought that I was going to keep them in for another week. And then I looked at the calendar and realized I had them in for a month already, which was as long as I wanted to go. So I just started taking these bad boys out. So I do hope you guys enjoyed this video. Of course, if you are new here, don't hesitate to hit that subscribe button down below. Click that bell. Y'all know the deal. And of course, follow me on social media, all that good stuff. But yeah, keep watching and enjoy the video. I forgot to mention, guys, um, typically when I take out my braids, I do take them out in sections. Like I'll take out a couple braids and then I will make sure that little section is detangled and I'll twist them up which is what you see me obviously doing here that's all I wanted to add so <laughs> enjoy the video for real now So I do apologize guys, this video is about to end really abruptly because my camera battery dies. Because I wasn't planning on um, taking out these braids when I started, I didn't make sure my camera battery was fully charged, but it lasted a pretty long time. So you know, I will definitely upload a video in the next few weeks of my wash day process after this so you guys will still get to see, you know, you'll still be in the loop with the process. but. 
Watching this bad man, my hair was dirty at that group. That matting was, was serious. But it detangled pretty easily, so I'm not even, you know, it wasn't too bad. But that's all I have for today. Don't forget to definitely give this video a thumbs up. Share it with a friend. Drop a comment down below. Let me know what you like to do when you're taking down your braids. And I will catch y'all in my next video. Bye.